Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. And don't forget to check out my Instagram page, which will be linked down below. And it's all things Bath and Body Works, so check it out. And today, I thought I would do some candles that are super, super strong from Bath and Body Works. I filmed this video a while ago and it got a lot of views, which tells me that you guys are interested in really strong candles like I am. That is my number one criteria when purchasing a candle is it needs to be strong. I need to be able to smell it. I want it to fill my entire house. So I decided to find, I think, 10 more scents to share with you guys. That way, you know you're getting a good, strong candle. And these are all from Bath & Body Works, of course. So let's just get into it. So first, I'm going to talk about a couple of fall and winter scents. Um, and then we'll get into more of the spring and summer ones. So you guys can purchase those now. Um, but first, I so first up, I have Sweater Weather. And this one is Fresh Sage, Juniper Berries, Aromatic Eucalyptus, and Fresh Woods. This candle, I really started getting into my Bath & Body Works obsession with this candle. It is literally fall time in a candle, and it is super strong. You really get the eucalyptus in there. And it just smells like you're out walking around on a nice, crisp fall day. And that's what it smells like. But this is super strong. This will fill your entire house. And I just love this scent. So that is sweater weather. And then next up, I have a couple of winter scents or Christmas scents, if you will. Um, the first one is The Perfect Christmas. And this one is Fresh Cut Pine Cinnamon Sugar Toasted Marshmallow. This candle is, like I said, the other one was fall in a candle. This one encompasses everything of Christmas. It's got cinnamon in it. It's got pine in it. It has like a hint of sweetness from that marshmallow. And it just smells like Christmas, everything Christmas wrapped into one candle. But again, this one is super strong. I think cinnamon candles and pine candles are really strong to me. So it just, it's, it's everything Christmas and it's super strong. So there's that one. And then next up I have under the Christmas tree. This one is Fur Balsam Juniper Berries Vanilla Eggnog Sage Leaves. This one is almost, I think this one is actually stronger than Fresh Balsam. I put Fresh Balsam in my last video because it is really strong. But this one I think is stronger because it has that cologne note. And I don't know about the eggnog, but there is something in there that's giving it kind of like a twangy scent um but this just smells like a christmas tree mixed with like a nice cologne and it's this one is super strong this one will definitely fill your entire house so recommend this one and then the last or the last winter scent i have is peppermint hot chocolate this one is Sweet Peppermint Silky Milk Chocolate Sweet Cream. And this one is super, super strong. You really, you get hit with that peppermint, but the chocolate doesn't drown out in here. You really smell like a rich, decadent chocolate in this candle. And it's not as strong as Twisted Peppermint, but it's definitely up there and you can really smell this when you're burning it. And it's a good mixture of the chocolate and the peppermint. Like one doesn't overpower the other one. It's a perfect blend and oh so strong. So <laughs> there's that one. And then now let's get into all of the like 
scents that you can purchase now, like the springy and summer scents. So first up, I have Watermelon Lemonade. This one is just Watermelon Ice Sparkling Water Meyer Lemon. This one is, I always forget that this one is super strong, but it really is. So I like the pink watermelon scent that they've recently put out, but it's not as strong as the watermelon lemonade in my opinion. I don't know if it's like the lemon that carries the, the it really packs a punch. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it, you can totally smell this burn when it's burning. And it just smells like candied watermelon mixed with lemon. It's a really delicious, fresh, fruity scent for spring. So I don't know why I keep showing it to you guys, but I mean, you guys get it, but watermelon lemonade. And then one that I love all year round is a good laundry scent. And first of all, I think they are pretty much all pretty strong. But if you want one that's really going to like clean out your house and just give you a really fresh laundry scent, I have to recommend Laundry Day. This one is my number one laundry scent. I pretty much don't buy any laundry scents, but this because it is super strong and really crisp and it just, it makes your house smell like fresh laundry. So uh, the notes are fresh air, crisp eucalyptus, and soft lavender. The lavender really gives it that crisp note. And this smells like exactly like laundry. So, um, sorry if you can hear that. It's my neighbors running their water. <laughs> um, okay. Anyways, laundry day, super strong. Highly recommend. And then another one that I always forget is super strong is actually French Baguette. The packaging on this is so cute. I think this is the original packaging, but this is the re-release they recently put out for um, Candle Day last year. So this one is Slow Rising Dough Crispy Crust Crust A Pat of Butter. And this one is super, super like crisp. You almost, it definitely smells just like, like a peach, piece of French bread but you almost get like a flowery note, like flower, because it's so crisp. And this one is really strong. If you want your house to smell like a bakery, I definitely recommend this one. I think that the original, when it originally came out, it had more of a buttery note along with it, which I kind of miss that. I don't really get it now. Um, but this one is super strong. It just smells like French bread. And then another one is I don't have the actual candle, but I have a variation of it and it is mahogany teak wood. I mentioned in my last video, black tie, which I do think black tie is a little bit stronger than mahogany teak wood because it's a little richer. Um, but mahogany teak wood is so strong and I can pull out that scent in, well, they have a bunch of different variations and one of them I have is mahogany coconut. But I will say to me, I don't know if it's the, I guess it's the mahogany, but I can smell that in every single variation that they do. That's all that I smell is the mahogany. I don't really get coconut in here. To me, this just smells like mahogany teak wood. And that's how I feel about pretty much all their pack repackages, except for mahogany vanilla. I think I can get the vanilla on that one. But the scent notes on this is creamy coconut, mahogany woods, English lavender. And pretty much all I smell is the mahogany. <laughs> I mean, I get like a, a hint of like something summery in here. But anyway, what I'm trying to say is the mahogany note in the candle is super strong when you burn it. It really fills the house. I can pick up that note almost immediately when I burn a mahogany candle. So if you want a nice, uh, cologne scent, go with mahogany teakwood. That candle is super popular and very strong. 
another spring scent I have. Well, actually, this one can go all year round, all year long, but especially in springtime. And I have Bubbly Rosé. This one is Pink Sparkling Rosé Sweet Blood Orange Splash of Cranberry Juice. And this one's just super fruity, but it is so strong. Um, I really pick up the orange in here and definitely the cranberry, but it just smells super fruity. And this is probably the strongest like drink fruity scent that they release other than the watermelon lemonade, of course, but this one is actually super, super strong. So if you guys love fruity candles, recommend this one. And then the last candle that I wanted to mention, I actually don't have it because it is a floral candle and it is fresh cut lilacs. That candle is super strong. If you love floral, definitely go for that one. It's almost like a little bit harsh. Um, I think it might have lavender in it, but it's super, super strong. If you guys love floral, I obviously do not have that candle because I don't typically go for floral, but it's perfect for spring. So I did want to mention that one and all 10 of these candles, you will not be disappointed in the throw on them. I promise you. So give them a try. And that's it for today, you guys. I hope you find some new candles and there is a candle sale coming up actually on the 5th. So if you guys want more candles, then definitely hit up that sale and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.